Hey guys, just really quickly wanted to let you know that if you have not ever checked out my channel website, or if you haven't looked at it in a few days or weeks, then now would be a great time to check it out. But after this video, of course. What's up guys, Jason here with episode 3 of The Bunker. In the last episode, we pretty much just got to this door right here, and now we are going to continue on from here. Let's see what's behind this door. I think this is the fuse box. I need to make the announcement first. That so do we do we do that on the microphone? I'm assuming we do that in here on this microphone. Let's see. Attention, the mains power yep. is about to be switched off for maintenance purposes. Why would you say that though? It seems that there's nobody here. Is the sound, yeah, the sound's still 40. Let's go back over here now. Now we should be able to use the box, hopefully. And we are about to turn off all the power, which means there is going to be no lights. Yeah, please, please turn it off for me because I have no idea how to use... Oh, man. Uh... That's the damaged one. Okay. What about Shut this power off. Okay, fine. I need to turn the power off. What that? Where? Where's the power? There's nothing else here. I should turn the power off first. Shut mains power off. That's the damaged one. What? There's nothing else here. Oh, here we go. Here's the replacement. Move this over here. There we go. Just perfect. Now we don't have any more. Replaced damaged fuse. Put the new fuse in there. Switch mains power back. Oh, no, we don't have to deal with the power being out, thank God. I've already replaced the fuse. Okay. Hopefully this power comes back on. There we go. Now what? Do we 
just go back now. I'm gonna try that. What's that horrible noise? Someone's, someone's coming to kill you. Can we go down here now? Doesn't look like it. No, I can't. You'd think he wouldn't be afraid of stairs when he had to walk downstairs to get to that spot. What the heck? Go back up. We might have to go in there and look at the cameras. So I'm, I'm going to try that if there's nothing on the first floor that I have to do. Okay, he's going back over there without me doing it, so. Please be okay, please be okay. Check the computer. Air filtration fouls. What do I do? I need to find an NBC suit. Uh, I have not seen any of those around here, sir. Wait, actually. You have one in your clothes thing, clothes locker. No. Oh my god. Wait, what is, what is this? I did not know we could go down here. I don't need the toilet right now. Okay. Storeroom. Wait, actually. Storeroom. Stop. Check. Does any of that matter? I'm not hungry. All right. Nothing in here but beans. Nothing in here but beans. All right. If you don't want food, then not my problem. What's in this room? Okay, blood's in this room. Date, 4th of July, 96. Patient's name, Vera Taylor. Patient reports headache from Monday AM, vomiting and diarrhea Wednesday. Also cough with occasional blood. Intermittent bowel pain, increasing pain in chest. Temperature fluctuating. Peaks at 100.5 degrees. Blood present in feces. Conclusions. Patient showing signs of radiation sickness. Plan. Sick base day. White blood count test. Monitor. Potassium iodide 130 milligrams orally per day for four days. Review. Possible DTPA course. Notes taken by Evelyn Jones. Okay. 
glad it reads it because if it didn't read it, then I would have to read it. Can I go out this door? I'm not even doing what it said to do. Matt lights up if there's a leak. Uh, it doesn't look like it's lining up to me, but sure. That door only opens in an emergency. Okay, so let's head to this room. How do I get back? No, 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 I didn't, didn't want to go back in there. No, get out of there. Okay, what's the way to get back? Right there it is. Go back in here. Let's see if you have that suit in your locker. Do I have to sit down and then press the button? I need an NBC suit before I can go to level 4. Do you have one in here? I don't have an NBC suit. Oh, okay, you don't have one. <laughs> well, it was worth a shot. I need to find an NBC suit. Yeah, let's go find it. Turn this down a little bit more. We go down the stairs now. Now he goes down the stairs. Just go, man. And where did that red light come from? I need to go down. Yup, you need to go down. Let's go. Are you so, why is he so scared to go down to the to the levels below? Is it because there's a monster down there? <laughs> Level three. Turn the light on. The wall room. The war room. What we don't know for certain is the contamination levels. We can calculate the likely fallout and its effects, but we don't have any good model for anthrax spore spread, or even how it's affected by radiation. Look, we do know from reports at AE3 in Oxford that anthrax was used in wave three. We've just got no idea of the extent of it. It's not as if we can go up and test anything. We can't even count the body. Okay. What's this? Not 
Mr. Churchill, it's an honor, sir. So I want it. What couldn't you tell me yesterday? There's no hope for any of them. I... I don't know. It's not radiation poisoning. The water's clean, the air is clean. Oh. It's not the food. It's not radiation poisoning. The symptoms. I can't shake the feeling that someone is up to something. Damn it, George. We don't have time for your fantasies. You need to figure this out with facts. We don't know where this thing comes from. Or how it will spread. We have no cause. We have no cure. We just don't have the resources to deal with it. There is no help. There is no cavalry. It's just us. So get yourself together and fix this. Do you understand me? What's what am I supposed to do there? For Christ's sake. That damn brat is a waste of air. And he's what the human race has got to look forward to. What? Hmm. Interesting. Soldier. Bravest fighter. <laughs> I'm dead. What is this? A waiting report. Okay, looks like it's like a map of maybe other people. Okay, we can't go back, so I'm just going to keep going on here. This can't open, I'm guessing, unless there's an emergency. It's locked. Yep. Go in this door. see what's in here. There we go. What was that? NBC suit safety guidelines in the event of a nuclear radiant leak the following items are essential for protection, checklist of components, protective clothing, respiratory equipment, radiation detection, Protection provided, highest available level of respiratory skin and eye protection from solid, liquid, nuclear, and ga gaseous. Gaseous or ga gases? I don't know. Gaseous chemicals. Ensure suit integrity has not been comprised by wear and tear, rips, or puncture before use. Ensure all zips and fastenings are sealed before entering contamination or contaminated areas. Okay. What do we got up here? Okay, did we we just took that I'm guessing? And we gotta take this suit. The suit that we just saw, a flashback I'm guessing of someone trying to kill someone in the suit. Now, can we go now? Yep.
Okay, we're putting the suit on. I'm gonna go down there. Okay, well, that's going to do it for this episode, guys. In the next episode, we're going to keep going further into this game. It looks like it might not be that long. I don't know. Maybe maybe it is long, but um, we're, we're going to keep playing it um, in the next episode. So, if you like this video, then make sure to give it a like and subscribe if you're new to the channel. Also, since we are kind of into the game now, uh, just let me know down in the comment section what you think of the game so far. And also, if you've played this game, tell me, um, tell me what you thought of it. So that's going to do it for this episode. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you all in the next video. Rock, rock.